Hey guys, Game Hunter here, and we are playing some Doom the Roguelike, and uh, I get to say it's version 995G, but GH, what could the G possibly stand for? Well, oh, and uh, yeah, I did some coding, so there's that. <laughs> um, the G, oh, it has got to highlight that thing, stands for... Um, Good? No, 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 it stands for something even better. I'm gonna play, oh, I don't know. Let's just do Technician. And Hurt, uh, Pay Not Too Rough. You know, I haven't really played a serious game on 995, although I have, you know, been writing the AI, so I at least know what to expect. So let's just get right onto it, and, uh, I don't know. I'll probably just do some kind of rapid fire build. Yeah, let's just do a rapid fire build. So we got all this stuff. And then, oh my goodness, it is playing with tiles. The G stands for graphical. And uh, I'll probably have put that in the title and there will be absolutely no spoiler. But, <laughs> you know how it goes. So not everything fits on the screen at the same time. But that's totally cool. Because it is tiles and... What more could you possibly ask for? So, let's just uh, move right along. I don't have all my normal setup, so it's going to be kind of weird. Oh man, look at all that blood. That's crazy. We are playing with fire today. Oh, how nice of him to have given me small med packs. So the AI is actually intelligent enough to kind of leave its normal position. If you notice, the shotgun guy came out pretty early there. I don't think we've killed everybody yet. Sometimes they're stragglers. Now, now that not everybody is going to be in the center of the map. All of the AI no longer have their default, we're going towards the center of the map and stuff. You know, everybody has a certain level of intelligence. So, let's just move right along. And uh, I'm probably going to just try to go through this game quickly. Um, yeah, basically uh, there are going to be spoilers all over the place. And if you don't want to be spoiled, I suggest you kind of stop watching. Enjoy the fact that you're already looking at tiles and blah, blah, ow. ow. That sort of thing. So, yeah, I'm just going to try to go through it quickly, and since it's on Hey Not Too Rough, it shouldn't be too hard to go through it quickly. So, I mean, a lot of the original graphic type stuff, at least everything looks kind of similar. Um, these are actually all hand-drawn, or, I don't know, based on, I really don't know, but the guy's name's Derek Yu. Um, he actually made, I believe, the alpha version sprites for desktop dungeons. I think. And if he didn't, I apologize, but I think he, I'm pretty sure he did something for Desktop Dungeons uh, early on. So, you know, there's that. But anyway, these tiles are great. And, uh, I mean, this game is <laughs> it's pretty, pretty freaking amazing. Oh, and we leveled up. So, let's just go ahead and pick some Eagle Eye, because I'll be getting Chain Gun soon enough with Hell's Arena coming up. Okay, that's everybody dead. Let's go ahead and equip some some armor. Um, I believe. Well, I, this is a beta. Not everything's done. Uh, when the public version's released, I'll probably do another video just to show that. When I do Doom or all stuff, though, I'm probably not going to use this. Uh, I'm just more comfortable with the normal ASCII layout. And, uh, I guess if a lot of people just want it, I will use it. But. Uh, You know, we'll, we'll try to figure it out as we go. Okay, and there's a demon. You know what I really like, and I'm not sure if it's if it's showing up properly, but uh, sometimes when when the enemies kind of move backward and then for backward because of knockback and then forward because of uh, getting hit, it it kind of looks like they're they're sort of like phasing in and out or doing some kind of cool blink move. And I just think that's really cool looking. <laughs> that's pretty much it. Um, of course, this isn't 
This isn't a game like that, so let's not pretend it is. Okay, we have a Kako Demon on the loose. And uh, as we know from version 994, these guys, you know, do stuff and, and keep their distance, but will follow around walls and everything. Okay, so, um, I don't know, I'm not trying to talk about the game too much. Surely, if you've watched some of my videos, you at least know the game. Um, but the explosions are pretty cool. You know, they're all tile-based, of course. They're not uh, entirely, uh, what's the word, uh, kind of meshed together. Although that would be hard to do, and I don't think Doom did that either. So, uh, that's not really much of a problem, in my opinion. How many shells I got? I got shells. Shells are not a problem. So, um, there's still a caca demon left. Yeah. There you are, you little caco. Okay, level three. Sweet. Oh yeah, there's supposed to be a chain gun I'm looking for. I probably should have been looking for it instead of just... Ow. Okay, well, it's a good thing you missed, anyway. Apparently, if you unsuc... Yeah, right, uh... There's some bugs. I'm just going to say there's bugs. And leave it at that. Um, you know, if you want to spot them, I guess we can... We can play, like, Easter egg hunting. Except instead of Easter eggs, you're, you're finding bugs, but... Oh, whatever. The ammo packs are the ones that look like big boxes of bullets and shell boxes and stuff. Just, uh, as a, a little heads up, I guess. Um, hmm. Okay, there you are. Haha, -ha, rapid fire attacks. Annihilation. Okay, so that's it. And there's the rockets. Haha, -ha, we get more than, than one rocket from these single ones. It's... That's always great. We get a whole lot here. It's, it's pretty crazy. So, we're just moving along really quickly. I'm just trying to go through this quick, because one that's on an easy difficulty and shouldn't be hard. There's a large med pack. Uh, oh yeah, and all the blood is like blood, so... Yeah, it's, it's bloody and it's in nice, neat little piles. <laughs> um... I don't think everything meshes perfectly. Basically, there's still some a, a little bit of kind of polishing of sprite work to be done. I think I don't know if tiles like this, for instance, will eventually be like a giant pool of blood. You know, whether or not that comes to be comes to pass is really up to Cornell and stuff. Um, oh, come on, drop already. I hit. I actually, uh, numpad, I guess, and num enter, the numpads enter, and the normal enter key can be used separately now that um, we're not using a console. Oh yeah, I should also mention, uh, for those of you who know the Sonic Clang remixes of this game's music, that's what's being played right now. So, uh, you know, Phobos Anomaly, or Hellgate, it's actually Phobos Anomaly in this, but... Uh, Oh man, I totally missed that guy. I totally missed that guy. There's a Berserk pack. Somehow, they don't uh, give me the same sort of glee when I see them like this. I, I think back to the original game and... Oh boy, a Berserk pack. It, uh, it makes my fists better. Yeah. <laughs> Certainly, there were more supercharged globes than Berserk packs, and I was always just fine with that. Uh, I guess I'll go for a hundred percent. I don't know. Just, it's really just a habit. Especially on an easy difficulty like this. So. I mean, why not? We're, wow, that's a lot of Berserk packs. I almost feel like I should use them. Huh. Okay, there's the stairs. Yeah, I'll, I'll use them to go down. And there's a guy, I think, at the bottom here. There you are. Took you long enough. Oh, let's see, what to get rid of. Um, well, this seems awfully familiar in terms of the kind of stuff I'll have. Normal, you know, in a typical sort of game, just carrying all the stuff everywhere. Uh, was there any extra ammo I'm leaving behind? It is kind of harder to keep track of things, obviously. Well, 
because we can't see the whole screen at once. I'm actually playing on an 800 by 600 screen, and I don't think it can be resized at the moment, but, you know, that's, that is something that we can kind of fix over the course of the betas. The public release will be a lot more polished, and yes, this is, like, really cool looking. Gotta admit. Like, I feel like I'm, I feel like I am totally berserking right now. It is, it is a great feeling. got this sort of music. Yeah, it's, it's really good quality. Hopefully you're hearing it well enough. Um, oh, that looks nice. You can I don't know if, how well you can see the transparency, but there's, there's lost souls right around here. Hopefully you can see that. Hopefully. Yeah. Maybe I should have switched to a better codec for this. I'm kind of just trying to stick with the DivX one because it seems to work awfully well, but maybe, maybe this game would have... Uh, done better with the lossless codec. Ha, ah, things are actually a little slow because there's so many of those guys running around doing their little thing. And also, that is a combat shotgun. Looks pretty awesome, I know. Uh, let us find this door. Oh, Evan. Okay. Let's push this barrel around. And let's shoot some lost souls and do the normal stuff we do against lost souls. Yeah, there's our combat shotty. Uh, I don't know why I really did it like that, but who cares? I did it, and it is done. Okay, so just... Oh, I guess it is a bit slow. Hmm. Oh, wow, that could have been really bad. Huh. I don't know why it's a tiny bit slow. Is maybe things are getting dragged down a little bit? Uh, well, let me clear the level first, and I will take a quick check. Hopefully there isn't sync, desync going on, I don't know. I don't know how much, how many resources this game actually uses. More blue armor. Okay, I'm gonna be right back. Okay, and we're back. And I'm basically, I just took out my uh, task manager to make sure that my CPU usage was, you know, looking pretty okay, so... And it looks pretty okay, so... I also closed my uh, browser, just just in case. Okay, let's find the stairs. Where are the stairs? Stairs are somewhere. I suppose that's a m another more difficult thing to keep track of. Because the stairs don't really stand out like the way they used to. And also, you gotta go searching for them. So, so there's that. Speedruns, well, I guess there's gonna be a mini-map, so that's... That's really not an enormous concern. How about here? Nope. <laughs> Let's find the stairs. Where are the stairs? Um. Hmm. Because, you know, I've been... Oh, wait. There they are. There you are. She is. Okay, good. So the, uh... Chain court is here. And we'll get to see... Some other guys, I guess. Oh yeah, this is a maze. Oh, also, I, I, this music is great. Let's just listen for a few seconds. Yeah, it's 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 cool music. Well, <laughs> I still need to work out the desync stuff. Wait, oh, wrong button. Somehow I got my fingers crossed in a different. Orientation. Anyway, uh, I'll just use this. Feels weird to pick up a med pack, doesn't it? When you actually put everything in a perspective of the. Oh yeah, he here's the good part. You get that guitar in there, all mix up. It's great. Is it me or our captain showing up earlier than they used to? Ooh ho! Level four. Thank goodness for a level four. Oh, let's see. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna level it the third time. Because you really don't need an eagle eye past the first trade. You can get it, um, if you're, if you're really insecure when it comes to worrying about, well, I suppose insecure is the wrong word. Um, if you are very paranoid when it comes to your accuracy messing up. So there's acid tiles. 
They're a little solid, but man, they look cool. And they seem to be, huh. I kind of remember there being an overlay that makes them glow. I guess the water's missing that too. I actually got to test out an alpha version, but I was sworn in not to uh, go around making videos of it. So, oh well. It was pretty cool. Certainly not as, uh, as working as this one. There were actually a bunch of sprites missing and stuff. Anyway, uh, let's see. Stairs and then red stairs were actually pretty close if I was remembering correctly things. Uh, uh, maybe not. Oh, well, they gotta be around here somewhere. I should really keep track next time. Like, I'm probably just going all over the place for these. <laughs> I'm sure my playtime's sucking. Yeah, yeah, turn count's getting pretty bad. I'll be right. Oh, well, here they are. Yeah, go figure. Oh, yeah, listen to that music. That's military bass music right there. Um, let's see. So there's a chainsaw. I wonder if I can do this the old fashioned way. Probably not, but uh, at the same time. It wouldn't hurt to berserk this anyway. If I can kill you on the acid, all the better. Ow. That's lava, right? Someone seems to be forgetting certain things about this game. How did I miss with a plus six? Man. Okay. Mr. Arena Master is close, kind of? Wait a sec. Uh, no, I didn't actually see him approach. Weird. Oh, there you are. Dang. But, like, oh, man, the mods are on there. Oh, whatever. I can probably just shoot you to death. Yeah, he's missing all of his, uh, noises. And he's already dead. Hey! Uh, is there any room for anything? Let's just use a med pack. And then we'll do this. Kill everybody with fire! Um... You know, I am a technician. I should probably be investing in tech stuff. Go we'll figure it out. Well, let's see. Power cell... I don't know. I, I like to have the ammo for chain gun. Okay, well, there we go. Oh, and that's a lot of caco demons. And that's like, oh, what the heck am I doing? And why is he just running up? Oh boy, I am not playing well. I'm kind of surprised that they just walked up to me like that. I am going to have to relook that AI a little bit. Or maybe just increase their attack chance. Aw, oh, there goes my armor. Well, everybody's dead, at least. Everybody's dead. Hooray. Okay, we'll just wear the blue armor for the time being. And my next two, next two levels are probably going to be... Wizkit! Just so that I can start doing crazy modding. Which... I hope to one day actually remove, because it horribly unbalances certain things about the game. Man, I need to be more careful. Well, I'll just use this med pack because there's a large one coming up. Okay. Oh yeah, this is a uh, this is a warehouse level. Also known as a pillars level, because I say so. <laughs> Phew. It's actually hard to notice whether or not you're going to hit something between uh, your target and where you're shooting from. Because, you know, this is a... that kind of thing. <laughs> Alright, good. Green armor. Uh, except I don't really have room for it. Because I'm not doing the assembly thing because of the whole you need level 2 whiz kid. Kind of a pain sometimes. That's one of the reasons I want to get rid of it is because it's such a weird mechanic. Yeah, who knows. I mean, it was Cornell that kind of put it in there intentionally, and it went unnoticed for, yeah, you know, a while. Can't really 
you know, I'm pretty sure it was 994 that it was in. Oh yeah, light amp goggles. So they make everything brighter. It is awesome. <laughs> okay, so I think I remember seeing the stairs on way on the right side of the map. So let's just go there. And, uh, yeah, okay, they're there. <laughs> Thank goodness for that. Oh, well, thank you for leveling me up. I really appreciate it. Uh, I believe this is a cave. I know it looks nothing like a cave, but... Oh, yeah, we already got to deal with wall. Wall is kind of tough. I will be quite frank. It is kind of tough. Um, we'll see how I handle it. Hopefully I, I handle it okay, Lee decently. Um, cool thing about 995, all the special levels are guaranteed. So, if you were annoyed that you didn't get to do all 11 special levels every single game, hooray! You can now. <laughs> so, there's that. Okay, so. For obvious reasons, I'm not doing Unholy Cathedral. I didn't keep my chainsaw. So, so I probably not, I'm probably not going to do everything, in fact. I'm going to Try to oh yeah right new song by Simon Volpert uh, brick song oh man I forgot to and eh, now I'm one rocket less this is actually a pretty tough place with the new AI everybody doesn't just bunch up at the center they will be crawling through so we need to figure out a good strategy for that and um, you know you know what I'm gonna do oh wait okay cool so um, it looks like this was kind of fixed a little bit, so it looks like one giant solid wall. Uh, which I am very glad for, because uh, when I was playing the Alpha, it just kind of looked like a giant, uh, you know, bunch of pillars. Are they crawling through? Good, they're crawling through. That can also be viewed as a bad thing. Because, like, I have no idea where they are. Like, where are these guys, right? Am I right? Or am I wrong? Ow! Can't believe he hit me from there. I didn't teach him to hit me from there. Okay. But this is what the chain gun's for. Severe firepower. Um, another thing you guys would want to worry about is that the uh, combat shotgun, tactical shotgun, and assault shotgun are all, um, how one might say, uh, more difficult to uh, use, basically. Ow! Um, and the reason for that is because their reload time is the same as the shotguns now. Um. Ow! Okay. Wait for him to shoot. I know that's kind of stupid, but... Yeah. Oh, wow, okay. I guess I'll just do that. This place is a lot harder now. I should probably just stick to the rocket launcher and blow everything now. You know, because it's already there. Assuming I hit properly... Ow. Well, that's what having the med packs is for. And not everybody's dead, but I think almost all the barons are dead. Come on. Not all of them, obviously. Missing one. And there's that guy. Okay, this one I can, I think, just deal with everyday normal style. Except not everybody's dead, so let's just go ahead and use another med pack. Oy vey. Yeah, this place is tougher than it used to be. That is for certain. Huh. This is going to be a pretty long video. Oh well. I guess that's what happens when you try to move things into episodic format. What's that? Episodic format? What on earth is that? Well, we're going about to find out. And uh, actually, I'm just going to let you guys listen to this for a sec.
Okay, that's long enough. There's the red armor. It basically just looks like the other armors. Okay. So, just pick up a bunch of stuff. And, uh, use our missile launcher. Except... Oh! Oh! What's this? We can't do the old Hellgate trick. By the way, this is called Phobos Anomaly now. It's not, it's not Hellgate. Um, but yeah, we can't use the old tricks now. So, we have to come up with other ways of doing this. My personal favorite is to destroy the wall on the other side. Or, you know, the, the rock. Whatever. Whatever you call that. And then just kind of make a run for it. So, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And then let's get out the combat shotgun. 12. Oh. Oh, crap. I destroyed a lot more than I thought I was going to destroy. Please don't accidentally kill me. Okay, good. That might be just about everybody, because, you know. <laughs> they all ganged up on me there. Okay, there's still a couple of lost souls there. Ow. But that's what the large health globes are for. So, yeah, this game is harder overall. That is a lot of blood. I don't think any of that is, is like, not normal blood, or whatever you call it. So, uh, also, these walls, also indestructible. So, you gotta play things the old-fashioned way. Fight the bruisers as they were meant to be fought. Just like this. Crap. Oh, that guy hit me. Alright, well, he's dead already. Yeah, um, because there were some fixes when it comes to the impact explosion stuff, I don't think it's a complete fix, but um, it's a lot easier to, to, to kill that sort of thing. So anyway, that's the Hellgate. Pretty awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next episode, where we tackle on the demo space. Demos, demos, whatever. This is Game Hunter, playing some graphical Doom RL. And as always, um, until next time, keep playing those roguelikes, and take care. <laughs>